I used to go to Bob's Big Boy Restaurant, and I went there for seven years, every day at 2.30, not Chinese dentist time. It was a Chinese dentist time, but um, I went there because they, I liked to have a chocolate milkshake, and there was a silver goblet shake. It wasn't really ice cream. It was a thing they put into, into a thing called a tailor machine, and it would get cold, and they'd pull the lever, and it would come out in kind of a tube of ice cream and fill this goblet. And I liked this chocolate milkshakes like that at 2.30. If you came during lunch, they made so many of them that it never would get cold enough to be a, a ice cream. It would be like soup. So I would go later, and then it would be cold enough. It would be just right. So, and I would, if I went later, I'd be so hungry. You know what I mean? So... Um, I had these things for seven years with a cup of coffee, and I would write on the napkins. It was like having a, a desk, and you need paper, there's a piece of paper, and you write on it when you get ideas. So the thing uh, is that I, I stopped going there. Um, I climbed into the dumpster, you know, about year seven, and I found one of these cartons that mil the milkshakes came from, and every ingredient ended in zine or eight. <laughs> and there was nothing natural any, anywhere near that carton. So one day, though, in Bob's, I saw a man come in. And he came in uh, to a counter, to the counter. And that's all I remember of this man. But seeing him uh, came a feeling and that's where that Frank Booth came from. <laughs>